Hello everybody and a good day to you all today. I am talking about The Center, season number two, episode number five, part five. This was directed by Sharon Davis. And here we have a little bit more explored in this world. Now you have you have Harry who is trying to save um Julian from his from, from where he's at. He's he's, in, he's he's locked up right now. And so he's trying to save him because he feels as though what happened to him was abuse and, and the reason why he killed somebody is because of the treatment that they gave him as a child where he grew up and so it's not really his fault so he's he trying to save him the best way he can and then you have Heather who's pretty much trying to, to find her friend Marin and pretty much I, I, I guess you can say if she is dead get the people who are responsible for her death now because they, they, they both want the same thing but they both going about it in different ways it caused them to be on opposite sides because see Harry sees a little bit of himself in style of Julian, and so he's trying to pretty much save him. And then you got Heather, who doesn't really know Julian is the bad guy, so she says he he needs to go to jail. But she but she also but she's just trying to get um trying to um solve the case about Moran, her her person she was in, a girl she's in love with, and so it it causes a lot of confusion between the two, and it also it causes a lot of disruption between um Heather and her her father and and, and um. And Harry, and also the um, the chief, the chief of the police in, in that town. And even more messed up, Harry doesn't remember what happened with, with his um, his counter that he had with um, Vera back in her back in um, in, in, in that cult place. He didn't know what happened. They were talking, and the next thing you know, he was home. He even tried to figure out what happened on, on the cameras and see what happened, but he still couldn't figure it out. And, he, and the thing is, though, he, he was at home. He and he ended up in the ho in the hotel room where the people were killed. He went there, and picked and got a room there. Why I I don't know. So he has a blank spot in his head. Now he said he also was afraid to to um to find out about, because he doesn't actually know what he did. But at the same time, it seemed to have brought Harry and Vera closer together in a weird odd way because both of them want the same thing: to save Julian. And you find out more about the treatments like the founder of this cult, um, um, Lionel Jeffries. And you see about his involvement and how, and how we got to this, to, the, to this moment in time. And you can even see how Vera, who was like full all in, wasn't, you can see that from the earlier stages. She wasn't even on board with a lot of the, the treatments that he was doing and getting people to like, express their inner thoughts and demons and fears and angers that they, they, they keep inside of them. Because it, 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 it gets really intense. Almost violent in a very a lot of ways, and then when he brought in this animal to pretty much be like the sacrificial lamb for their inner demons, it's like it started getting even more creepy. Like, oh, you get you starting to see the early stages of the cult and how it just starts to evolve into this weird, messed up, um, ritualistic type of way. Yeah. And you're also getting flashback of Marin and her connection with the cult. And also seeing that she was pregnant when she when she when she when she came back. Now I'm I I I'm starting to think that Marin's baby father is um Heather's dad. I could be wrong on this one. I don't know. But he has but uh, Jack, Heather's dad, has a connection to Marin. They they established that in previous episodes. Now I don't know if he slept with her or not, or maybe he knows who the baby father is. But I'm starting to think that he's the baby father. And there's, and there's a reason why he wants his daughter to stop investigating this, to leave it alone, to, to, let, it, to let it die. And I think the chief of the police may, may know about it too. So, ugh. Yeah. So I can't wait to see where, that, where, that's, where, that's, where that's going to go. For right now, things are still, still, get, still coming out. Things are still being explored. We still don't know exactly what exactly what's going on as people yet. But I am enjoying the journey and stuff, stuff like that. And you're also seeing Julian. He's starting to realize that his mom cannot be there for him. And it makes, it, it makes him lean more towards um, Harry. And and then that... And then you say, so you got Vera... Who cares about Julian? Who wants him on her side? But you see her. You see him slowly losing losing her son to Harry, which is very interesting, 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 interesting to watch. Just watching them, watching them going back and forth off of one another, because it's not really love there. I, it's hard to describe what it is. It's like they, like 
Okay, Harry doesn't really trust Vera, doesn't really like her, but yet at the same time, they have this intense connection between them. That's, you, that's every time you see them together, you can just see it. It's like, uh, and, and, but I, I couldn't, I can't really explain what exactly it is. And then also you get the, the connection between um, Heather and Marin, and you're seeing their past, and you start, you, and then you realize that all this time they weren't really a couple. It was this Heather who was not. I guess she wasn't. I guess she wasn't out yet, and she was. Just, and she came out to not. I want to say she came up. She, she came on to Marin. And then maybe they slept together, maybe not. Maybe they just made out. I'm not exactly sure. They don't really go into details about that part. But they promised it would never happen again. And and then Heather just tried to blame it on the alcohol. Like that, that, that's the excuse why she did it. But we all know we all, we all know what the real case is. So, like I said, nothing really. It, it didn't really answer any questions in this episode. It just it just, it just gave you more questions that instead of answers. And so, but it also the thing, but the way it's done is still very interesting. It's it's still creepy because you because but it also keeps you curious, make you want to know exactly what's going on in this messed up crazy world. Like who's connect, who's connected to who, how they connect, like who's covering for what. I mean, is Heather father the the baby uh, father of Marin? I don't know. Does he actually know who it is? Is the chief of police involved in this whole situation as well too? Help him cover it up. I I don't know. I don't know. But for now, is the show is still done quite well. The acting and the performances from everybody is, is, is great. So, and the, the way the story is told is just fantastic. So, it's, it's another great episode. So, leave your comments down below. Let me know what you thought about this episode of The Center. If you haven't watched it, check it out for yourself. Hopefully, when you watch it, you will enjoy having fun watching it too. So, give my channel a big old like and thumbs up. Shabam and subscribe to my channel and share. I would appreciate it, like I always say, in my dreams and in my life. I am the Ninja Rabbit. Uh, peace out, uh, peoples.